Tefano, also known as What's Up Fams, we have made it here at Pakeho Kai here in Wanneroo Markets. I'm so excited. We've met the lovely crew behind the scenes, Christine and her beautiful Fano family. It's time, fams. Super pumped. They're just getting our food ready now for us to do our food review. Exciting times, fams. Let's check out the store, let's check out everything they have. Much love, Fano. Let's go! Cuz this is where the beautiful magic happens, my brother. Man, it looks fantastic, man. There's plenty of years gone into making this beautiful kai, eh, my brother? Oh, this is just, this is just a plain one somebody wanted. Like. Fine, no, this is where the magic happens all here. All oh, this beautiful kai, exciting times. I'm surprised they let me back here, eh? Bloody hell, because I can't get my hands to myself. Look at all this, fine, no. Whoa. Yo, what's up fams? We're here with my good friend. Dean Petrie. Dean Petrie. Now, he is the manager of this amazing venue. Brother, obviously the crew here have been here for a little bit. Has it brought a different dy dynamic to the store with a different culture coming through? Absolutely. That's what we focus on, all right? The One Room Markets is such a wide range of communities and cultures, and we try and bring them all together here. Uh, we've only been here for a brief moment, and already we feel welcome. Beautiful. So, man, thank you so much for everything you're doing behind the scenes to make this all happen for yeah. everyone. Beautiful. Brother, Thanks for coming appreciate down. You. Appreciate thank it. Thank you, my man. Yo, friends, we are ready for our Kai review. We're here at Pakeo Kai in Wanneroo Markets, fams. First up is Pawa Burger. Let's bring this out, Fano. I've got to bring this out. Check this out. Oh, what do you mean, Fano? Look at that. Look at that, Fano. Look at that. We ain't going to muck around, man. Let's test this out. So the texture of the bun is amazing. It's soft. The Pawa itself is warm. We're about to bite into the patty and everything to see this goodness, Fano. We're going in. I was on a cutter, but we are going in far no. Oh. Mm. 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 Wow. I don't have my whanau, I know I've got kai all over my face. But I had to dive into that. The texture of the fry bread is absolutely amazing. They're fresh as. The patties are cooked to perfection. With the power smothered over, not just on top, but through it. It's given it the most amazing texture. And with the runny egg whanau, oh my god. The power burger, first off the bat whanau, has a 10 out of 10 for me. Unbelievable. Father, I'm not even lying, man. Nah. I'm not even lying, cuz have a bite of that. That is so fucking on. All right, Fano, next on the menu, we have the muscle chowder. Also, with the cream power over the chips. Everything's nice and warm, as you can see. Uh, the steam's coming off it. I'm gonna dive into the muscle chowder first, Fano. Mm. Wow, I wasn't expecting that. The sauce is spot on. It's creamy. Even the mussels are perfect. So usually when you dig into a chowder, the mussels are quite hard and you're chewing for a while. But wow, I'm really impressed with that. The sauce is real creamy too, which I like. A lot, a lot of people like it spicy, but I'm really digging the cream effect here. So, nah, beautiful. Mmm. Could eat that all day. Onto the chips with cream power covered on it. Now, this is a cheat code, Fano, honestly. Everyone loves chips, Fano. When you got fresh cream power poured on top, you cannot go. <laughs> oh. 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 
Oh, another day is the tomato sauce, my note. We don't muck around with tomato sauce, are we on with the cream pie? Look at that. Uh. Look at that. Mmm. Mmm. Mmm, perfect. Absolutely amazing. Mmm. On to the next. Now, I'm sure all of you is watching out there, especially you aunties, there is a rule of thumb about raw fish and who makes raw fish. Now, throughout my years, I've had some amazing raw fish whānau, and I'm quite particular on a raw fish. So this is an honest assessment here. Oh. Okay. Okay, it's not bad, um, but it's not good either, Fano. No disrespect, I'm giving you an honest review. Um, the texture of the fish is quite, quite, quite tough, and um, I'm finding it, I'm having to chew in quite a lot. Also too, um, I think it's, it's, it's a bit too sweet, it could have had a bit more salt, and just the sauce is a little bit um, tamed, if you know what I mean, where I sort of like a, a sweet sauce to, um, to really, really sink into the to the fish a good raw fish you know all the flavors sink into the fish itself and then that produces that flavor for when you bite in so uh, that's just my honest opinion no disrespect i don't want my um yeah yeah that's my review on the raw fish now also this is another one too everyone out there says they do a good fry bread use all the green Use all of that argument, no, 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 but yeah, I do the best fry bread. So, we're gonna do a fry bread chest. Now, first thing I like to do is check the texture. Quite honestly, look at that. That's bending, that's beautiful. Look at that, most fry breads you get too, they're quite um, puffy, but also crisp. With these are amazing, they're like, the texture of it's really good. And if we break it open, look at that. Look at that whanau. That texture is perfect. So when you're biting in, the texture of that is absolutely amazing. Because we all know that we like to put a real butter on this and really mix it in with all the power. The fry bread for me is amazing, which I think really made the power burger pop too because of the um, texture of the uh, fry bread really let everything else come together. So fry bread, Perfect. All right, Fano, the main, the main course meal, which is the hangi right here. Now, just let me have a look in here. Okay, we got your basics. We got some stuffing in there. We got um, some pumpkin. We got some stuffing. We got some, what's that? We got some meat. Is that mutton? And some beef, maybe. Some chicken. We got some cabbage underneath. Now, I was brought up, Fano. I was brought up making hangis, Fano. So, whew, I'm really excited about this. So we're gonna dig right in and check the texture. Now I always like to go for the chicken first because the chicken for me, Fano, is where we make sure everything is cooked. So, nice and beautiful in the middle, let me see. Wow, that's nice, it's really nice. Um, the meat is moist, it's, the texture of it is really, really good, so not good. Where's that stuffing? Mm. Look at here. Mm. Mm. Sorry, fun, I'm getting carried away here because it's so nice. What's good though is um, I'm looking at the bottom of it and nothing is burnt. Nothing at all is burnt in there, which is an awesome sign that the kai has been prepared well but also cooked well. So already that's a big win whanau. If the hangi isn't burnt on the bottom, nothing stuck to it, that's perfect. But some stuffing. Mm. The stuffing isn't dry, which is good because the texture of it's really good because um, it's had a lot of the other meat too to soak into it, which is really nice, but 
Mm. All in all, Fano, that is a good honey. I've tasted every bit of meat, every vegetable, and it's all nice and tender, and everything's nice and soft. So, ma'am, beautiful honey. All it needs now is some tomato sauce. Most important, I'm uh, really excited about this one, man. I'm, I'm going to eat dessert with a fork. But it's like a half fork, half spoon, so we're on. First thing on the menu, Vano. Ooh, oh, no, look at that. Steam pudding, Vano, with some custard. Oh, look at that. Look at that. The custard's warm too. So, oh, you know a good steam pudding, Vano, when you put your fork in and it just drops in. Look at that. It's just dropping. Ready? Look at that custard too. It's just like it's just basking in it. Hey, look at it. It's just settled in it. So we're going in. We're going in, Fano. Hey, titty, 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 you. <laughs> no, no, it's yucko. I'll no, make you sicker. I don't want any of this. Mm. Absolutely amazing steam pudding and custard. Oh, we need another. Dessert number two we're going to try a find out is an almighty classic. One of yours, one of mine favourites. The classic... Ambrosia. Now as you can see, we've got flake on the top, we can see our marshmallows, but we are pretty much going to dig in and see what this is all about. Ooh. That's gonna give you the gout, this one, cuz. Fano, telling you right now. Any of you who's got gout symptoms, it's no good coming here because holy heck to the tui of the tech of Fano. It's worth it though. It's worth it, gout. Fano, it's worth it, gout. They've definitely used ingredients from New Zealand for this because the yogurt is different. The mash, uh, it's unbelievable. Whoever made this out, rekaka, auntie, if you made this out and you're listening, Auntie! <laughs> ah, right. Sorry, sorry, just having a moment there, Fano. Mm. 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 That is the icing on the cake, Fano. I'm not even going to lie. Probably one of my favourites. Only because. It all blends in perfect. I love an ambrosia, it's one of my favorite desserts. And this right here, it's that good that I'm gonna go and buy a couple and take them up home after this. That's how good it is, man. All in all, I know we've done a review of all the main kai here. And I just gotta say, I'm absolutely blown away. Everything here that I've tried is quality. It's everything that I wanted, everything I needed. And I cannot recommend it more to anyone out there that wants to come down here and try this amazing food here at Pākehu Hokai and Wanneroo Markets in Perth. Do yourself a favour, Fano. Come down and support a local business that's trying to do big things, that are doing big things. And bring the family down. Come down and have an amazing kai. Have awesome conversation. I just want to say thank you so much, Prue, for having me here today to review this. I'm now going to go for round two and get more because it's absolutely amazing. Oh, yeah. Oh. Thanks, bro. Yeah. No, no, thank you. Fano, we're here with the man with the magic hands. <laughs> the man behind the scenes. Brother, I just want to say thank you so much for that amazing kaya. I just reviewed it, bro, and honestly, I cannot praise you enough, brother. There's some, there's, there's one thing about our kaya that people don't understand. I think when kaya is made with love, you can feel that, and I honestly felt that, bro. And I just want to thank you for letting me experience that. No, no. And I encourage all the whānau out there, come down and get some kai, man, because it's absolutely amazing. Thank you, my brother. Thanks,
Whānau, we're here with the beautiful, most amazing scrumptiously armchairs. Auntie Christine, how are yeah. you, my lovely? Good, thank you. <laughs> First of all, um, from me and the team, we just really want to thank you from the bottom of our hearts for having oh. us down here today. No, thank you because <laughs> everything that we have tried today has been mind blowing. Okay? Oh, cool. And I know my <laughs> Kai and I know if you can tell her, you know. Woo! So I just really want to take this time to thank you, man, because the hospitality you've shown us, you know, yeah. the love, yeah, but also you. saying to our, our, our man with the golden hands in there, <laughs> you know, food is food, but when food is prepared with love, yeah, that's, right. that's the difference. And yeah. that is 100% what we got here today. And everyone out there watching, that's watching this video, I encourage you to come down and see Auntie, come and see the man with the magic hands, find her, come and get Kai. You're going to see the links in this post and everything like that, where to come down and see the Fano. Come down and support. But also, too, you're going to get good quality Kai. So thank you so much, man. We love thank you. you. All right. Let's go, fans. Kai. Oh. Hello, sir. How can I help you? Welcome, welcome. Now, if you'd like to, sir, check out the menu above there. All you can eat, mate. All you can eat up yourself. Now, because you're looking fantastic, sir, because you're looking fantastic, I recommend fry bread, sir. Eh? 